in my office, I've seen pictures of it, you know that there are a lot of cardboard cutouts there. And uh, so there's the British Royal Couple, there is Sheldon from Big Bang Theory, there is Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz, and there is Iron Man, and periodically there are other people. Unexpectedly, last week, my boss decided that there needed to be a cardboard cutout of me. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I found this uh, quite uh, shocking, but not something that uh, can't be done. Of course, it can be done. That's what I thought. But actually, cardboard cutouts are done in like runs of 100,000 or something. So you have to have a really big market, right? Whereas plastic cutouts, you can do like get one or two of them. So any of us might want a cutout of ourselves, likely to be plastic. I, I didn't know that. Plastic is called uh, choroplast, very similar to chloroplast. Choroplast, yes. So, um, and there's a lot of interesting discussion in science about plasticity. But it turns out dictionaries do not agree on what plasticity is. Like if I pick just some plastic object, does it have plasticity just by being plastic? Half of the dictionaries say yes, the other half say no. Who knew? So, Anyway, I, I, I'm sort of contemplating how to confront these stand-up images of myself, which will exist next week. You'll see them. You'll see how I do coping with this. And that's what the poem is about. Plasticity. Limitations of language can themselves be poetic. They are like little elves of rhetoric. Dictionaries disagree on the meaning of plasticity. Some say it can mean just the state of being plastic, while others deny that meaning entirely. Amazing that dish dictionaries can be so spastic. This past week I confronted my own plasticity when cardboard cutouts of me were produced out of choroplast, corrugated plastic, you see, and thus was my essence reduced to these slightly leaning back structures that when confronted can contribute to neuroplasticity lectures, however discomforted may be I, may I be feeling, looking them in the eye and reeling. Ladies and gentlemen, that's the problem. <laughs> Dictionaries are highly plastic. They change all the time. All right.